one department, one mission. The Alabama Department of Rehabilitation Services is the state agency providing services to individuals with disabilities over a lifetime. ADRS offers a continuum of services through four major programs. Alabama's Early Intervention System, Children's Rehabilitation Service, Vocational Rehabilitation Service, and the State of Alabama Independent Living Homebound Service. Each program has a distinct role, but all work together, creating a seamless transition from program to program through such services as specialized medical care and therapies, vocational training and job placement. ADRS makes self-sufficiency and independence possible for Alabamians with disabilities. Early childhood development is essential to the growth and success of all children. But for a child with a disability or developmental delay, the early years are crucial. So Anna Pruitt came to us from the hospital right away. She was referred and we came out to the family to see them for the first initial intake and for evaluation and assessment. When you bring her home, but you don't know a single thing about caring for a special needs baby, that's where the value and the importance of early intervention has been for me, at least as a dad. Early intervention provides services to infants and toddlers and their families through a community-based, family-centered system of support. With the focus on the child's development, EI staff work directly with families to meet the needs of their child. This has helped me see that all the options that are out there for her and all the help that could make her life better for her. And so in that, it's just made me more confident in the fact that, hey, she's, she's gonna be fine. And today she feels more confident and where she is and, and where she's going with early intervention and their next step with the school system. And if we can have every family say that, I think that's the true success of early intervention. For parents of children and teens younger than 21 years old with special health care needs, Children's Rehabilitation Service can be a valuable resource. Community-based offices around the state offer a team approach to bring together healthcare specialists from many fields providing services tailored to each family's needs. CRS and early intervention always, you know, helps us to figure out what the future holds for her and to make sure she's able to complete that goal. They watch her uh, move and see how she moves and see what else they can do to make her mobility better. Well, mobility is really important because that's how kids learn. They explore their environment, they get in, into things, and they learn about what's going on by interacting with it. If a child with a disability is in school, CRS collaborates with school systems to provide expertise and consultation for assessment, evaluation, therapy services, and assistive devices to give the child the support he or she needs to succeed in the classroom. CRS does a good job of making sure that it's easy to communicate with them, the parent, and the student. So without CRS's help, then um, it makes my job a lot harder being able to communicate with the student. So they're helping me be able to be a more effective teacher. I would have like C's and D's, not A's and B's, because I can understand what the teacher's teaching. Vocational Rehabilitation Services General and Blind Deaf programs offer employment and educational opportunities to individuals with disabilities. VR collaborates with vocational schools, community colleges, and universities statewide to help students with disabilities receive appropriate educational opportunities. When I was a freshman in high school, I started noticing cars and I thought maybe I'd like to work on cars. And I let ADRS know, and they advised me to go to EH Gentry and improve my skills. I could understand now what deaf culture really was. My goal is to graduate Lawson State, and I would like to continue working here part-time until I graduate. For individuals with limited mobility, cognitive disabilities, and low vision, 
ADRS offers adaptive driving services statewide through the ADRS Lakeshore office located in Birmingham. The program provides vehicle modifications, evaluations, and driver training for teenagers and adults with disabilities. When it comes to employment in Alabama, VR works closely with employers, community rehabilitation programs, and other state agencies to match people to jobs. Having a partnership with a business means that they can pick up the phone and call us at any time, um, that they feel that they need services and we'll be there. They actually do the initial recruiting and decide who would, is suited here, what job they're suited for. Can they comply with our policies? Do they have a strong enough background that they can do the jobs that we have? They also go out and train those people. The State of Alabama Independent Living Homebound Program offers life-sustaining services. For people with more significant disabilities, living in their own home instead of a nursing home is the best possible outcome. In the beginning, I felt so bad. I just wanted whatever folks would do. That would be just fine. But now, I'm grateful for whatever measure of independence. I can achieve. SAIL assists individuals with significant disabilities in maintaining and regaining as much independence as possible, while the SAIL VR hybrid program offers consumers the opportunity for education and employment. I never in a million years thought that I would be able to come to a place like Montevallo, you know. But then I met the folks at ADRS and now I'm here and now I'm starting to get an idea and a picture of what I want to do with my life. I mean, if I didn't have ADRS, I wouldn't be able to come here and be doing any of the things that I'm doing now. For thousands of Alabamians with disabilities who face challenges, whether the person is a child born with a disability or someone who acquires a disability later in life, the goal is the same, self-sufficiency and independence. With individualized services provided at homes, schools, the workplace, and the community, ADRS assists every person in achieving his or her maximum potential. Our work is about the individuals we serve. Their stories epitomize the heart and soul of our efforts and highlight their determination to succeed despite significant obstacles. Every baby, child, teenager, and adult who comes through our doors has a unique set of challenges, needs, dreams, and aspirations. That's what motivates us. That's why we strive every day to provide quality services that pave the way for long-term success. One department, one mission.